Hello and welcome to Business Intelligence Solution Providers India, BISP and I am Anil Patel uh, and uh, today we will show installation of Informatica 8.6. Informatica is 8.6 is a ETL tool. Uh, this is a leading ETL tool in market. For installation of Informatica 8.6, we need to prepare our system. There is some prerequisites. For installation of Informatica 8.6 for Windows platform, first we need to install any database like Oracle, SQL, Teradata or any RDBMS and our system should be supported by Java. I am using Oracle 11G <coughs> database and uh, in database we should create a user schema for installation of Informatica 8.6 and for that we will create a user which name is BISP it could be any name. You can see the syntax for creation of user schema and uh, how to grant privileges to user. Just open SQL developer from Oracle 11G home. Now open a connection. Now here we'll create a user. Just follow these syntax for create user. Create user username identified by password and this syntax for grant privilege to username. Grant connect DBA resource to username. This is syntax and a query for create user now run now user is created successfully now we can see user is created now we need to grant privilege to user so grant connect comma DBA resource to username then run the command now user has grant for connect db and resource successfully then prerequisites are finished then next step is to installation of informatica 8.6 so how to download if we don't have so we need to download from oracle website free of cost so just uh, go to oracle.com or uh, follow this link so now open browser and paste then you can see this is a welcome <coughs> page from Oracle Software Delivery Cloud. Now uh, just select a product pack. <coughs> so just from drop down list select Oracle Business Intelligence then after you can select a platform for Oracle Business Intelligence here n numbers of platform available so we'll choose Microsoft Windows 32 bit or you can choose according to your need then click on go we have to select uh, this version so select Oracle Business Intelligence 10.1.3 media pack for Microsoft Windows 32 bit. After select, press continue. <laughs> now, uh, Oracle Business Intelligence 10.1.3 media pack for Microsoft Windows 32 bit page is open. Now, we have to download our request version. Uh, Informatica Power Center and Power Connect Adapter 8.6.1 for Windows 86 32-bit. This is in two parts. 
uh, first part and second part so download both now we have downloaded successfully Informatica 8.6 uh, this is both part uh, first part and second part and this is key for Informatica here a uh, two part uh, is uh, specified one is for client installation and second one is for server and third one is key of Informatica 8.6 now for installation of Informatica 8.6 there is steps so first we need to install Informatica server then client now uh, this is steps for installation first we need to install server installation so then after server installation we install client for Informatica so open downloaded folder for server PC86 server win 32 double click and open then here install dot bat file so execute install dot bat file then double click on install dot bat file then installation is uh, start you can see a uh, welcome window of Informatica is open now we need to select language so I'll select language English then OK then welcome window of Informatica is appeared uh, read down everything carefully then go to next press next second window is appeared of Informatica here uh, choose installation type window here we have two options first is for installation power center 8.6.0 and second is for upgrade to power center 8.6.0 so we are installing fresh Informatica 8.6 so click on install power center 8.6 then press next power center license key window appears then here we need to uh, browse path of key so just uh, our key is uh, located under this folder you can see just browse go to desktop and Informatica 8.6 and Informatica 8.6 key then select then open then click next now next window installation prerequisites is open here you can read each and everything uh, installation prerequisites uh, domain configuration database here we necessary to at least one database Oracle DB2 SQL Server service uh, we choose uh, Oracle 11G as a database then here this space at least 750 MB then press next now read uh, instructs uh, information then press next here we need to define path for installation of Informatica in our system uh, its give default path or we can assign path then press next next window HTTPS configuration here no need to change anything then press next now uh, here pre-installation summary presents here we can see a product name uh, installation directory <coughs> HTTPS status that is enable and shortcut folder uh, re disk space requirement uh, now press install now installation of Informatica 8.6 is uh, started it will take a uh, few times uh, Informatica is a very powerful ETL tool lots of functionality features this is steps for installation of server now you can see SOA based 
extensibility and reusability Here, here we can see uh, steps, number of steps or uh, installation. Now we are in uh, fourth last step that is installation. Now create or join domain window is up here. Here uh, we have two options create new domain or join existing domain. So we'll choose create new domain then click on radio button then press next. And configure domain database window is appeared. Here we need to uh, fill information for domain database. Here we need to define information of database like uh, user we created and uh, its password uh, URL from uh, Oracle 11G. Just right click on connection and go to property. Here we can see uh, information of uh, host name, port number and SID. So in host name when we install Informatica and configure so here host name local host is default but we use our system name in place of host name. So host name is computer name so how to find computer name just go to start and go to my computer right click go to property and then here you can see a computer name my computer name is BISP DBA so here I'll place uh, BISP DBA now test the connection so this is the uh, information for configure domain database my database type is Oracle database URL here I will put host name and colon port number I'll choose your host name as a my system name and port number 1521 it's default for Oracle 11G then a database user ID that's user we created BISP info and its password then database service name that is SID here we have ORCL so enter all these information in configure domain database so fill all all information here uh, and uh, carefully fill information then press the test connection now our test is successful test connection passed then press ok then press next now now in configure domain window uh, there is a uh, we need to fill only uh, domain password so we can choose any password then then press next now creating domain and note for informatica power center 8.6 uh, it will take a uh, few minutes next window is configure Informatica services here uh, we can insert password or leave it blank now press next you have to remove the checkbox uh, this this checkbox run Informatica service under a different user account so uncheck the checkbox then press next now again it will take a few seconds uh, this is a final step of uh, installation of server of Informatica Power Center 8.6 now it's uh, successfully installed we can see a summary and press done now server installation is finished then next step is to we need to install
client for Informatica 8.6 so just uh, open uh, PC86 client underscore 32 for client installation software then click open then run install dot back file then it's started now here same process again we need to select language then ok then here we need a welcome screen for Informatica Power Center client 8.6.0 then press next here uh, we select uh, install Power Center client 8.6.0 for press installation then select icon then press next then this is installation prerequisites just read carefully then press next this is a location for installation then press next this is the pre-installation summary for client then click in install now installation of uh, client is running it's a very simple installation it will take uh, only few seconds now we can see we are in final stage of installation now uh, uh, post installation summary window uh, press done now we have successfully installed Informatica 8.6 we can check uh, Informatica 8.6 just go to start all programs then Informatica Power Center 8.6.0 here we have server and client our Informatica is ready to use for more details, please log on to bisptrainings.com and bispsolutions.wordpress.com. Thank you guys.